Hello, this is Brad from Dick's House of Sport, and a little more on Bryson DeChambeau, our U.S. Open champion this week. Uh, we've got him, and this is his 2020 swing, so not like his most current one, but I think we can still learn a few things. So, last time we talked about his big, wide banana, right? So he takes it back pretty wide, and definitely transfers weight, and I would say he gets stacked a lot earlier than most on left. Okay, so he's a front post golfer, he stacks and rips. Okay. But one of the things I want to look at today is this left knee. Hopefully you can see this, but in the swing, that left knee doesn't necessarily go back to the ball too much. It goes forward. Okay. This is probably one of the things that a lot of golfers can really benefit from. Notice that knee started more or less over the widest part of his foot and goes out a little bit back toward the ball, but not much, okay? It doesn't necessarily get behind the ball at all. And then even from the top of his backswing, you can see it's starting to move forward, okay? This is gonna help simplify your swing because you have a lot of sway in your swing. It's probably coming from your knees. A lot of people think about it's the shoulders, but I think it's really the knees that are creating that motion. And that's another pretty wide arc, right? So this is where he starts pulling back, okay? Notice when that club gets about vertical, or what I call the tipping point, that knee is starting to drive back, okay? Not sliding toward the target, but launching up and back, okay? And around. So if you look on a face on, you kind of see this. Notice how level that stays for the most part, right? So it does go forward and down a little, not much, a little, and then it's ripping back and up. So if you have questions, you want to hit a little farther, a little straighter, please reach out and give me a call at 952-401-4653.